So while it's good to have a nicer, more polite page to deal with page not found errors, it's better to have no page not found errors at all. So let's go ahead and create a new page for our custom tours page. Um, what I'm going to do is copy the path from the URL so that we can use that inside of our alias for our content. And I'm going to jump back to the browser where I'm an administrator and I'm going to add some new content. I'm going to add a basic page and this is going to be a placeholder and so I'm going to call it custom tours. I'm going to go ahead and leave the body blank and by doing this we don't tie a text format with the content yet. So that means that the site editor if they have permissions to use other formats than I do as an administrator, they'll be able to edit that content right away instead of having to deal with potential permission issues. We're looking at the menu settings here and we want to decide whether to provide a menu link or not and where to put it. Let's go ahead and look at the mock-up to see if there's an item in the menu. And sure enough there is, it's right after calendar. Okay, so let's go ahead and provide a menu link and the title is custom tours, that's good. We'll leave the description blank for now. The parent item is the main menu. And as a wait, let's go ahead and do a guess. Let's say that 15 will bump it to the right of the calendar. And I'm gonna click save. Okay, so now we have our custom tours item right after calendar, looks good.